Conditions have been very dangerous out here all day long. It's a search that lasted for more than five hours here this evening. Evanston rescue crews were able to save three women from the water here, but the search now suspended until tomorrow morning for a 41 year old man who's still missing in the water. Dangerous conditions across Lake Michigan today causing problems in a rescue attempt for the Evanston Fire Department. Crews responding around 4 o'clock this afternoon to four people in the water. Two teenage females, one adult female, and we had a 41-year-old male. Uh, the three females were brought in uh, with the assistance of one of, our, one of our citizens who were at the scene swimming. It's unclear at this time if all four swimmers are related to each other. A beach hazard warning has been in effect all day with high winds creating four to five foot waves, which impacted the search this evening. With the conditions of the water and the waves, it's just zero visibility out there for us. Zach Nellis was on the beach with his family when rescue crews arrived at the scene. And hopefully they find the swimmer and hoping for the best. Uh, you know, it's strong current out there. Fire officials say it's critical for people to follow the beach hazard warnings when they go into effect. Well, when we put the red flag up, it's, that's, that's there for a specific reason. No lifeguard on duty. You're, you're entering the water at your risk, and we don't want to have what happened today happen to anybody else. Now, the Evanston Fire Department is not sure exactly what time this search will continue, but they plan to be out here bright and early in the morning in hopes of finding that 41-year-old man. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.